Well, what's up YouTube? I came up here today to do some fishing. I've been coming to this spot for, I don't know, probably close to 15 years I've been fishing up here. I come to the river on the Conestoga. I've been fishing a long time. A lot of people come up here. A lot of people come up here to swim and hang out and everything. And I get up here and then look what I find. I'm all up and down this place. Sign, 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 sign. No trespassing, hunting, or fishing. Violators prosecuted under penalty of law. What the hell? That makes me so angry. People have been coming here for forever. I mean, forever. Up here 15 years or longer. And, man, I'm irritated. I come up here to fish, walk up the river. They don't own the river, but unfortunately, they probably own the land that reaches. They just put um, a little RV thing down there. Somebody bought this land, probably. And that's that. But they're going to put all up through here. No trespassing, hunting, or fishing. That's just crazy. I find that to be extremely crazy. They don't let nobody fish or hunt here anymore. People riding by. I don't know, I'm pissed off. I'll be honest, guys, I'm really irritated because I've been coming here a long time. I love fishing this river, it's so beautiful. I mean, I'm in shock a little bit and I'm a little upset. I can't believe it, I can't believe it. All right, guys, I'm gonna run down here see if I can't find another spot to fish. Well, guys, I'm pretty pissed. I'm upset. It was weird. I went up there today. went up there to do some fish. I ain't been up there in a little while, but I fish up there a lot. So I got up there, and as soon as I pulled up and I seen all them signs, I was like, man, I am mad. I'm real mad. I was mad. I was real upset. But, um, I mean, there's nothing I can do about it. But I think, I don't know. I don't know. There's not much I can do about it. I called the number on the sign, and, um... Nobody, I couldn't get an answer, but I don't want anybody to call that number. Please, if you say don't call that number, I don't, I'm not encouraging anybody to call the number or harass nobody. I'm putting that out, I don't record right now. I don't want nobody harassing nobody, but um, at the same time, it's just upsetting. I mean, it is what it is, there's nothing I can do about it. There was a guy that moved in right next door, and I actually went over and talked to him, so I was that upset. I pulled in there and I was like, Hey man, why'd you put them signs up there? And he was like, what? I didn't do that, I promise, and all this stuff like that. He was very uncomfortable. He was a little nervous. Maybe I scared him. I don't know. Um, but he just was like, no, I didn't do it. And I was like, he was like, I bought this side and all this. He's like, I don't know who done that. I was like, yeah, it sucks. A lot of people have been fishing up here. And there's a lot of people that go up there. And maybe it's not going to be as noticed right now, but later on a lot of people are going to be upset and mad about it. I think someone local, maybe the county did it. I don't know. I have no idea. I know a lot of people leave trash, and it's an unfortunate thing. And that's what happens when people go in these places and they dirty places up and stuff like that. The Conestoga Sea is kind of like a really clean river, especially that section and on up. So they're pretty, you know, they don't want people dirty and stuff up. So maybe they just closed it out. But see, I was trying to call that number because I wasn't going to complain and be like, hey, why'd you do that? You know, I was going to be like, hey, you know, I've been fishing a long time. I got a YouTube channel. You know, I'm trying to work my way in where I can keep on fishing up there. So I'm going to keep trying to call them. And see if I can talk to somebody so I can work my way in there. But that's just the way life goes, you know. It sucks. I've been fishing there a long time. That's a beautiful section of the river. I went down to another section there, and I did fish for a little while. And there is a section down there, but I normally don't really go there because a lot of kayakers and people drop their kayaks and they float to Georgia. So I don't really mess with that spot that much. But if I'm going to be fishing that area, I'm going to be walking there next year. I went down there, and I didn't catch nothing today. So maybe I wouldn't have caught that, anything in that area anyway. I don't know, but... I just wanted to rant about it. I'm pretty upset. I've calmed down about it once I've got home, but it does cut one of my favorite fishing spots off because the fishing there is so pretty. You can watch my other videos. Maybe I'll link some here uh, to other videos I've made in the past there. It's so pretty. But I appreciate y'all guys for watching. I'm just upset. It's the way it goes. But I just thought I'd throw this out there because it pisses me off. Now I'm mad about it, but there's nothing I can do about it. And that's just the way life goes sometimes. We keep restricting things when people mess up stuff with restrictions and restrictions. Then wonder, people wonder why they can't do anything. It's because we keep restricting the damn world. You can't do nothing if you just keep restrictions and restrictions. restrictions. Eventually, we're all gonna be walking around a box with a cell phone, being like, "I can't do anything. All I can do is walk around, you know, on our imaginary world in a, in a game because we can't do shit." That's why I like games. Like I play video games. I play like Red Dead Redemption and stuff like that. It's like this. You think, oh my God, look what America used to be like. It was so wild and free, and you can see what our forefathers seen, and now it's the same shit where we left from to begin with. It's just, it just is what it is, and it just keeps getting bound up. Everybody just keeps wanting to put rules and laws and rules and laws and rules and laws, and you can't do anything. You can't enjoy the world, period. But whatever. I'm not going to keep ranting about it. I'm upset. 
I appreciate y'all guys for watching this video. If you're new to this channel, check my videos out. I make busy videos. Hit that like and subscribe button. And to all my subscribers who watch this, I appreciate y'all. Thank y'all for watching. And it's unfortunate we can't fish the Conestoga right there no more. But maybe things will change. Maybe they'll take it down. I imagine a lot of people will go through there ripping. And they're going to spend a lot of money ripping signs down. I'm not going to do that. It's not my style. But I know people will do it because there's a lot of people who go there. I appreciate y'all for watching. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And as always, I'll see y'all guys later. Y'all guys take it easy. See y'all.